In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Yamaha Steinberg USB driver, which is required for all USB communications between your Mac and your Montage or Modi X, including multi-port MIDI communication and multi-channel audio. Let's just go and take a look at audio MIDI setup, which is located in the Utilities folder of the Applications directory, and you can see that I've got the built-in audio devices for this computer set up here, but no montage device, despite the fact that the montage is currently connected directly to the computer from its USB to host port. If I also come up here to Window and look at MIDI Studio, there's also no montage device there either. So, to get started, we must shut down the computer completely. Not restart, but shut down. So let's do that now. When the computer has fully shut down, press and hold the power button. Keep holding. And when this screen appears, you can release the power button. Head to Options and continue and wait for the recovery mode to load. Next, select your user profile and enter your password. Ignore this prompt for utilities and instead go to the utilities menu and select Startup Security Utility. Select your disk and click Unlock. It will ask you again for your password. And now click on Security Policy. If it's currently set to full security, change it to Reduced Security. And then select the Allow User Management of Kernel Extensions from Identified Developers option. You don't need to worry about the Remote Management option. Click OK and it will ask you to authenticate again. It will now apply the security policy and then you can restart. Now that we're back in the macOS home screen, we can download the driver. I'm going to head over to my browser and type in Yamaha Steinberg USB driver. And I'm going to download it directly from the Steinberg site because it's actually slightly newer than the one that's available on the Montage Downloads page. I'll pick up the Mac version and download it. Now, I'll open my Downloads folder and you'll find that there is a driver installation package. Let's open that and go through the steps to install. This will now bring you up a security prompt. So in this case, we need to open system settings and you'll see that system software from Yamaha Corporation has been updated. Click allow and authenticate. You may need to authenticate twice. It'll then prompt you for another restart. Now that we're back on the macOS home screen, we can go back into Audio MIDI setup. And sure enough, we have a Montage M device with six output channels and 32 input channels. And if we open MIDI Studio, we'll also have a Montage M device showing four MIDI ports. Uh, this will show Montage or Modi X if those are the devices you're currently connecting. And just to check that we really do have communication, if I go into System Settings 
and open sound, wherever that's gone these days, and change my input device to be the Montage M, then any notes I play on the Montage M will register as input. And that's it, you're ready to go.